Hello Deb. Hello. Alright. Is it that time again? What time? Garden walk around time. Garden walk around. Mm. Yeah, if you like. It's looking alright, apart from the grass. Good, you have a quick scan and then, uh, on, then. you can take everybody round the garden. Make show sure them what's you going go on. Up in that tree. Ooh, I'll go up and I'll catch the washing as well, should I? Yeah, sorry about the washing. There you Ain't go. Most, it's a garden. <laughs> yeah, this tree has a clematis in it and the clematis has kind of took over. I chopped this down last uh, last year, put it at uh, uh, fence level. Now look at it. Anyway, this is not my video. This is your video. <laughs> is it? It is. Well, it's our garden though. Okay. Yeah. Maybe we just do a walk around then, shall we? Go on, go Why for it. Can start these? Seeing as you just bought me a new lilac tree, standard. Looks like the flowers are just beginning to start to open. And look, calla lilies are finally coming through. On that one, this one and that one, but not in here. Hmm. I'm standing in the shade, aren't I? Get in the shadow. Dahlias, it looks like something's eating them, look. Yeah, and the hanging basket's filling out nicely behind you. Yeah. I think these are double petunias. Mm -hmm. They're quite fluffy. What's in there then? That, that looks like it's got everything in it. Well, these were left over after we'd done the hanging basket because it's supposed to be a winter pot. This is my head and then my grass, but these just petunias and the Okay. Yeah. This hosta you bought me off eBay last year, just last year. And look at it. Mm, gorgeous. And peony in here, I take it? Yeah, it's not doing very well. I think it's been waterlogged with all the rain. Look down there. It's dying off. Mm. Not good. No. And they've got over there. Yeah, the tulips have finally gone over, but they were gorgeous when they were out. I just put a few um, geraniums in. Mm -hmm. There were lilies in there, but the bulbs had rotted. And you, my new thing to hold my lupins up. <laughs> yeah, a bargain from Stamford, that was. It was. A young man selling uh, all sorts of ironwork there. And it was brilliant. Including the the ball over there, which we'll have a look at in a minute. Mm -hmm. Look at my clematis. Isn't that lovely? But that's supposed to be a double clematis that looks like this. That's the label. Now, do those flowers look like those? Um, we've been set the dirt, take it back. <laughs> yeah. Look at this hosta. Was I that... think I might have to move that because the black lace will take over. Was that another eBay special? Yes, I think it might have been. <laughs> yeah. My black lace I cut down to the ground last year because the flowers kept falling off and it was just wilting constantly. So I chopped it back and it's come back with a vengeance. It's looking very healthy. It is. Unlike, the, Unlike um, <laughs> the lavenders. Yeah, the lavenders. They've not survived this year. No, a good show last year. But, it was um, beautiful. Yeah, but they're looking pretty poor. So I think I'm going to take them all out and rethink this bed. Yeah, it's not looking it's not quite looking as good. No. It's a shame because they really did come well last year and uh, they were looking really gorgeous and smelt lovely. And it was lovely sitting here and smelling the lavender, wasn't it? But... Yeah. Yeah, disappointing, but oh well, that's gardening for you. Now I've got a job for you soon. Um. Because when you step right back, I actually stood in that doorway when the dog was out. Right. You can kind of see a spherical shape in the tree. To be fair, it was kind of a ball. And, and I think it would look great if we could chop it back to a ball. Yeah. But you've put lights in it now, haven't you? I'll take those out. Yeah. I was going to do it this year, but it yeah. just constantly rained. Never got a chance to. No. But yeah, it does want shaping up again. It does, and I think it would look nice as a ball. Mm. Especially with the ball, ball. Ball, ball. ball. <laughs> We've got a theme going with balls. Yeah. <laughs> Where's Ted, by the way? Oh, he's over there. Oh, he's over there. Look, there he's go. sulking because we had to bath him. Yes, he rolled in poo today. He rolled in dog poo, <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah, we wasn't impressed. 
I brought my um, aces over near the water feature after seeing a picture on Pinterest as you do and I thought that looks Japanesey and the rock with the pebbles but this one I don't know what's wrong with it it's not done very well for the past two or three years so if it don't perk itself up it's going maybe chop it right down and let it grow up again well they lose their leaves don't they mm. so yeah mm. so that's that little bit and the lawn's been well scarified this week yeah it has and again I think that was all of the rain when I kept walking around with the mower there were so many dead bits in it and it was driving me crackers because it was beautiful last year weren't it it was really lush don't step up you've got a dog <laughs> behind you so I got the scarifier out yesterday and, come back. Um, yeah I've kind of messed it up a bit but yeah, it always looks like that when it's been scarified it'll yeah. be fine give it a couple of months it'll be luscious and green but it's been fed so hopefully it will come back yeah. I bought this for Julia because it was variegated I don't know whether you can see, just on the edge, they were yellow. So I don't think it was in a sunny enough spot. So I've moved it to see if it comes back. That's a diddy one. That was uh, in a plant selection that Stacey gave us, along with that <laughs> crazy thing. <laughs> Whatever it is, yeah. We've no idea what it is, but it was in a... A plant. Yeah, she bought us a nice little arrangement, little for pots. Christmas, wasn't yeah. it? With and, Christmas um, in. Yeah, they got put in the garden. Yeah, and uh, going all right. Yeah, <laughs> the hydrangea. That's mm -hmm. come back a treat, hasn't it? Is that? I'm going to say geranium. Is yeah, it, it is. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm not good with plants. <laughs> I, I don't always remember them. Mm. So that's no, because so that's one of the Italian cypresses. Mm -hmm. I love all those Mediterranean gardens. Mm. They're beautiful. But I did buy that. That's a lime heuchera. I think it's key lime pie heuchera, if I'm correct. Mm -hmm. Put some little violas in for a bit of colour. Mm. And you chose this plant. It's a phlox. And look at that. Yeah. Candy tuft, I think it's called. Yeah, it just caught me eye, the leaves. Yeah. yeah they look like you could eat them. <laughs> yeah, that's looking like a bit of a, a lettuce that's gone over. <laughs> well, it's a fern. I think it perhaps gets a bit too much sun mm. just there. I might yes. have to move it. I'm not sure it's supposed to be like that. No, it isn't. It's no, it's definitely not. Dead, no, yeah. it's supposed to only be green. So what I might do is dig it up and put it over there somewhere. Over where? Over, over there. Where your monkey puzzle tree is, because that that's mm -hmm. really shaded over there. Well, the, this dark, this section is shady but this end bit does get a little bit so it obviously gets a bit too much and this bit's gone wild yeah well this is honeysuckle honeysuckle yep. yeah you missed the jasmine that's oh. gone mad as well look yeah. and i chopped that right back if you remember we did the honeysuckle if i remember yeah. last year or the year before that's done well the still be mm -hmm. but they like wet soil which is what they've got and that is a laurel is it no that's no? a polka dot plant Oh. That's already flowered. They have little blue and pink flowers on together. It's a bit like a laurel. I know, it does, mm. but it isn't. And that's a grass, I that's assume. That's grass, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. And more hostas. Yeah. <laughs> Hiding under the trees. They'll yeah. love it there, in the shade. It's got a euonymus just there as well, Luke. A what? But that's a euonymus. So I may have to move that, because I think that that hosta's going to take over, because that's one of them giant ones, mm. isn't it? And this maple has just gone... Wow. <laughs> and I took, I got, I crawled onto there and I took all the lower branches off. And again, that, that was after seeing a picture mm. on Pinterest. And another hosta. <laughs> we yes. like hostas. That one, if you remember, started coming up under the pit of spore. Right? Yeah. We planted loads of hostas, including next to the shed there in the gravel yeah, uh, a few years garden. ago, but they never came back. Don't show the messy corner. <laughs> That's a burning wood. Yeah. Um, I've got another clematis at the back there, look, and it's got loads of buds, mm. but it's just not coming up very much. And one of my purchases, I like the look of it, and I think, when I, well, I did definitely when I grew up, our neighbour had one like this, and I remember it being quite big and tight, but um, it was very small, and I said, well, plant it there, because it will hide a little bit of the shed in that area, and um, yeah, it's gone crazy. And look at all the new growth on it. <laughs> That's going to be <laughs> massive. But the shed's got to come down soon as well because it's, it's yeah, worse for wear. Yeah, we need a new shed, don't we? Yeah, it's, it's yeah. about at it now. Yeah. That was another one of in a, a basket, a flower basket that Stacey bought, uh, bought me. I think it was a Mother's Day thing. Mm. 
-hmm. So when it was dying off from the basket, I transplanted it into that urn. Yeah. It is like a Grecian urn it's in, you just can't see it. <laughs> yeah. But that's gone crazy, it's oh. beautiful. Hostas. <laughs> is there a theme in this garden? Mm, I do like The hostas. theme is it needs a good sweeping. Look at the it state does, of that. It does, look at it. Um, that was another eBay bargain. <laughs> Have you found something else to roll in? Don't you go rolling in anything. <laughs> <sighs> Not Little monkey. Today. Yeah, it needs a bit of a clean up in this area. Trouble yeah. is, this is gorgeous when it all, uh, all flowers. And it, it is quite private, sort of screens all the hairs at the back. But... Um, it's just a mess and, and when it starts dropping it turns brown and it just oh it's horrible stuff but we're so, constantly sleeping it aren't we yeah i did sit there for my breakfast this morning mm -hmm. now this i bought last year at the end of the season and it was about a pound because it was dead so they thought but i could see some little green shoots at the bottom look at it now yeah it looks dead and, and talking of things that are dead, and I'm going to bring this up, <laughs> this big olive tree here, apparently four years ago, five years ago, was dead. Somebody dug it up and chucked it in the corner, and I went, that's not dead, it's just dormant. No, it's not, it's definitely dead, so I planted it again, as you can see. It's not dead. It, it's not no, dead, is it? No. <laughs> well, it came from my dad, my dad gave us it, and um, when we, we did plant it, and for about two years it just did nothing did it <laughs> it wasn't yeah. great but um and it lost its leaves and everything yeah. and it just looked very very sad so yeah and here's something i always wanted monkey puzzle tree and it it was a tiny little sprig when it we was. first got it but it's um i think it needs a bit more room now it doesn't seem to be going up it just seems to be going oh, out it is going up yeah it is but i it mean it's about so, that size when yeah, we got they're, it they're so slow growing yeah. it's unbelievable eh? Yeah. It'll probably outlast me to boil it with it. It'll outlast me. Yeah. And a eucalyptus tree at the back there, which which seems to have yeah, it's, it's followed the it sun. It needs to be <laughs> put up or, or chopped. Well, or we something. had one before at Northborough, and mm. uh, that followed the sun as well. But yeah. There you go. But yeah, this corner is just um, it's like a tropical oasis. Um, again, these uh, bamboos were just sprigs when we bought them, and they're well, they've took over now. They're brilliant. And so was the oleander. Mm. That was tiny when I put it in. There's another hosta. Oh, yeah. That's a big one. Yeah, for a change, there's a hosta. Yeah. yeah. What's at the back, though? Is that calla lilies as well at the back? No, not calla lilies. I think they are not day lilies, the other ones. can't remember the name. Yeah. I'm, having a, I'm, I'm having a moment. It'll come. It'll come. Mm. Yeah. And then, uh, and then you chose this, didn't you? Yes, for the I love the flowers on it, yeah. Yeah. Flowers are gorgeous and it matches well with the, the blue flowers on that as well. And that's called lemon and lime and yet it gets blue flowers. It's very strange. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then exactly. underneath, hidden, is a, a white geranium. Mm. And we've got, what's that? Peach tree. Peach tree, yeah. yes. We managed, what was it, two peaches last year off it before the birds got them? Yeah, the birds soon get to them, we they, don't. They get them before we do. Mm. Yeah. A couple of little geraniums in there. Yeah, they were left over from the pots yeah, as well. Probably need so. some more ground covering. Or maybe just to mulch it, I don't know. Yeah, it does need mulching. I've yeah. done that side, mm -hmm. you can see, but I haven't done this side. Yeah, oh, well, it's going to need a lot of... Um, oh. Found a twig. Yeah, he likes eating twigs. found a twig. You're a silly Crazy boy. Yeah. Oh, another hosta there, but that's been well eaten. Yeah, but there are new leaves coming at the back since I've put the... Um, Oh, the slug, plates, the then, slug yeah. pellets, but it looks like it needs some more slug pellets. That looks like a Mediterranean plant. It's as well. a sedum. All right. Yeah. That's a Veronica. Okay. That gets white spikes. I've got no idea what this is, and I don't think I planted it. Hmm. Whatever it is, it's it's pretty. pretty. So I'm, <laughs> I'm going to leave it. Yeah. And as I remember, this bamboo was a twig off one of off one of those. Off one of those we just stuck in there just, when it broke off. Yeah. And there's been loads of new ones come up, look. Wow, all we need there is some pandas. I'd love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I can tell you what this one is. There you go. Hucra, what's that one then? What's that? I've no idea. That's I'm a Nandina. Just... Of course it is. And it hasn't grown any, so I don't know whether it doesn't like it, but according to the tag, it's in the right position. But it just doesn't go. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not dying, but it just and hasn't grown. 
Yeah, that, that was another one that came in a little basket from Stacey Lou. Yes. Just like that one. It's that over there. Oh, no. Yeah, there was two. Yeah. And that's the red one and that's the pink one. Or have I got them the wrong way round? I don't know. I think there's one showing on here. Yeah. Yeah, this is red. Okay. It's not open, but you can just see yeah, the red in the bird. The yeah. yeah. So, yeah, again. Oh, here's one, look. Yeah. Yeah, so again, roses that just came as part of a flare arrangement. Came in little tiny, like a patio rose. Yeah. In a little selection for Mother's yeah, Day. Yeah, Stacey buys us loads of bits and stuff like that. put them out and see what happens. Oh, well, that looks, that's a bizarre pond. Well, it's a hebe. All right. But if you look, half of it's died at the back. Ooh. Yeah. But the front's okay, so I left it. Mm. Those are your daisies that started life in that bed over there. <laughs> they didn't like it over there, but they like it there. They like it there, yeah. They're going to need splitting, I think. Mm. And the funny thing is, I bought some more. I forgot we'd got them. Where mm -hmm. are they? Here. Is that them? Yeah, daisies. There's some more. <laughs> so, we've got a few mm. of those. This thing is an orange Trandoscantia. And when I bought it, it was twice that size, and it's come back this year, and it's half the size. So I, I don't know what's it. Perhaps doesn't like our soil. Mm. Possible. It's another, been a wet winter um, though. This is another oleander, mm -hmm. which is great. I mean, they they grow like weeds in the med, don't they? Mm. We always comment on them. And there's where the clematis starts. Yeah. It's just there, that thick twig. <laughs> that scary thing at the back there. That's where it starts and it goes up and up and up and up into the tree, all the way up there. Yeah. Teddy, yeah. what are you eating? Orange blossom? No. No? No. Ooh. Ooh. I can't remember what that is. Ooh. It'll come to you. It'll come. Yeah. Yeah. And then that was another purchase of mine, as I remember. I fell in love with that. No, that's no? another hydrangea that I got from my friend Maria. Ah. Who, she got it from work for me. Ah. Yeah, it's called Glam Rock, but okay. it was over there and it didn't like it, so I moved it and it's mm -hmm. took off. Oh, yeah. And this was hacked back last year, as I recall. Well, this is our hibiscus that started off enormous, like a huge shrub up here. But this half of it died, and these bits, that was the main stem that died, and these were offshoots of it that have carried on, so I've left them. I don't know, mm. but these are crossing, so I'm going to have to do something with that else we'll get disease in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then what's that then? You know what that is? No. What was that one that you said over there? I don't know, that was five minutes ago. Geranium. Geranium. Yeah, oh, right. another geranium. Hardy. These are the hardy geraniums. Right. And then this little green thing here is my Chinese plumbago. I wanted a Chinese plumbago and I ended up with four. Yeah, because somebody was watching them on eBay, wasn't there? Yeah. And then somebody bought them because usually when, pe them when people watch three. things on eBay, they end up getting bought. Yeah. Because it's a bit of a hint, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, oh, more yeah. balls. More balls. <laughs> more balls. Yeah, yeah. And balls with lights. That. Uh, see them. There's a cutting off that one, which okay. has seemed to be taken off. Now this border's a bit, you know, a, it's turned a bit, in or there, it's turned one. a bit bizarre. We was going to do alpines in here at one point, but it's, I yeah. don't know, what's, what's in there? Well, we've got lupins, obviously. Lupins, yeah, that's a choicea. Mm -hmm. I think that's a little tiny hebe. Yeah. I have no idea what that is, and that's another hebe at the end. Hmm. But this one has kind of, it's not, it's yeah, fallen it's over, it's not enjoying it? it, is it? It's not happy there, is it? Uh, so I might have to. All sorts of bits and bobs in. Yep, yeah, they're just summer annuals that I thought I'd plonk in there and then mint for when you make me a mojito. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, this one. Now then, what's this then? Remember? Ooh, Japanese maple. No. No. That's close. No, you weren't. Okay, I weren't. Go on then. Wrong continent. Lemon tree. Lemon tree, that's yeah. the one. And it died, if you remember, it was just a load of branches with no leaves or anything and mm -hmm. it looked very very sad out there mm. 
and I dug it up and took it in the kitchen and this is what's happened. <laughs> I brought it outside today just to get some sunshine. It's recovered. But it's recovered beautifully. Mm. Haven't had any flowers yet. But yeah. it's still growing. Yeah. So. And another pot with all sorts of bits and bobs in it. Yeah, well whatever was in there had died. So mm -hmm. I thought, well I've got an empty pot, I'm going to put some colour in it. Mm. Yeah, and then... An attempt at tomatoes. Attempt at tomatoes. <laughs> My dad's friend grew these from seed, Ooh. so dad got some. I, thought, and I saw some bran in there, I thought it was a tomato, but it, no, 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 these bland. are just cuttings <laughs> of yeah, um, the hebe. Yeah, i Yeah, but they look as though they're doing all right. They've got some um, flowers, and that's where the fruit comes from, isn't mm. it? Yeah. Another and hanging then, basket. Another hanging basket, which are, they're filling out, they're just, the pan no, not pansies, the olas are in full throttle, but... Uh, Nothing else is as yet, but it will, it'll come. Mm. So yeah, I'm quite happy with the garden, apart from the grass this year. Mm. It'll come. Yeah. There you go. All right, say goodbye to everybody then. Bye-bye everybody, have a good day.